Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on The Witcher 3, so uh, we're ready to rock and roll here. I had some audio issues. I think you guys probably noticed in the Fallout videos. Um, I kind of got, I uh, kind of changed the format on how my recording software all works out, and so it readjusted kind of the audio, uh, and then it added a different option for PC audio. Uh, which was cranked all the way up, which I don't know if you can hear it in those videos. I didn't check that. But hold on. I need to be over here. Uh, I need to get. need to start paying a little bit more attention. But, but I tested it out. Everything seems good now. So uh, if there are any issues in the previous videos, it should be resolved now. Uh, there should not be uh, any, any issues from here on out, um, except with the fallouts, because I pre recorded a bunch of those. If Johnny's real, he must leave prints. So that is uh that, that that is a possibility for issues that could still remain. Is I think the next few days fall out. I think a while since till like Sunday have an issue could have the issue. Um, it sounds like the game audio is a little loud. Uh, by what I took from uh, listening to it and trying, but there's nothing I can do to fix it now. Small uh, They've all been uploaded. Johnny's and, been through uh, here. Can't really do much editing at this point. Uh, so that that that's kind of an issue, but I guess you guess those episodes, you know, it's just gonna be the issue at hand with those episodes. Uh, nothing, nothing I can do, but hopefully the Witcher here will have no issues. Let me go ahead and put Gwen on. I think this will be a better option. Um, are we? Okay, I guess we're not. I guess I killed the enemies that we were gonna have to fight. Um, extra uh, on the way to the on the way to Johnny here, uh, but. I tracks lead to a to. burrow. Just have to Wonder talk what's to Johnny, inside. The sword away. Call Johnny out of his hole. Johnny. Don't be afraid. You're a Bucca? A Luton? Ah, a godling. Not many of you left. I'm looking for a woman with ashen hair. Seen her? Tell me everything from the start. Where did you see her? What was she doing? It's important to me. Why not? What's wrong? Can't talk? Why? Lost your voice? Can I help you somehow? Want me to follow you? No choice, I guess. All right, let's go ahead and file, follow Johnny here. We'll see, we'll see what we can get in, what trouble we can get into. Try to protect Johnny on the way to get his voice back. Is that kind of new over there? I don't remember seeing that before. Not like it's not new to the game; it's just new to me. Damn it! As we all know, even my first playthrough, I guess, I guess I did a bit of exploring in that one, but not nearly as much as I'm gonna do in the completionist, obviously. Okay, let's calm down. Okay, there's a two-hit strong attack. Kill, okay. Stop. What now, you piece of filth? Okay, let me go ahead and put some food on, even though we honestly don't have that much food. And I don't honestly have that much money. Where are you, Johnny? Stay close to me. Let's go, little buddy. I guess I gotta zigzag because I run faster than him. So we'll zigzag, get him to move a little bit faster here. Head up, we're gonna head up to the nest. Wherever it is, I think it's, yeah, it's right here. So you get the kind of weird run. Of, I wonder if I can still do it. Let me look around.
Something's on the ledge? Something that'll get you your voice back? Guess I gotta make this climb. Alrighty, let's go ahead and head up. Let's see if I can still get it. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. Come on. Damn it. Alright. It wants you to go around, but I go up hit the, I go up this way. I went up this way in like every in both of my playthroughs. But I don't. I guess maybe it's not gonna let me. Right there! Oh I just missed it. Damn. Alright, hold on. I think I got it. Right here. Right here. Nope. Okay, we'll go around. I'll take the way it wants me to take for the first time ever. There we go. Alright. Not bad. Not bad. Not nearly as fun or effective as my usual way, but it'll work. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. I was trying to click A to pick up the, uh, see if I could pick up the item, but I couldn't, and it rolled me off the cliff. Come here. Not bad. Come on, harpies. Come on. There we go. Alright. And harpies down. You maybe he meant this bottle. Feather. Let's go ahead and loot this harpy, I guess. The rest, like, fell off the edge, didn't they? Oh, no, no, no. They fell off the edge, but their items did not. Lesser blue mutagens. Come on. Um, there she, there it is. Please give me another lesser blue mutagen. Yes! Nice! Let's go ahead and, uh, make a blue mutagen. So now we have enough lesser, and then I will go ahead and throw this on. Let's go ahead and throw on the blue, the regular blue mutagen. Nice. So these are all, like, different mutagens. Yeah, they're from Wraiths. Uh, so you can't combine those, which is stupid, because it makes no sense. They have the same effect. Could just meditate, I guess. Alright, Johnny. I got your voice back. Here. Drink up. Drink up, little buddy. Rubbish! Bumblebee! Flabbergasted! Ha! The sound of it! Peter Piper picked Prince Proximo a pack of pickled peppers by the pontar. <laughs> Done celebrating? My favorite words! Life without savoring the sound of surreptitious shenanigans is like licking snails through a cloth. Thank you for this, noble whoever you are. Long be your life! Hang on a minute. I helped you, now you help me. Would you turn this beautiful act of altruism into a banal bartering of favors? Yes, I would. I'm looking for a young, ashen-haired woman. See anyone like that? Did I ever? Remember it as if it were yesterday. Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. My favorite part of the day. Defecating to the sunrise, downright glorious. Suddenly, heard a bang. So loud, it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared, out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired, just like you said. Wounded and panting to boot. She raced off towards the children's huts. Quick as if the crones were after her. I yelled some unpleasantries. She disturbed my morn. Sadly, I'd lost my voice, so I don't think she heard me. I get you, Johnny. I'd be pissed if someone interrupted my morning, my morning break. She ran off toward the orphanage. Kids could know something, or the old woman who takes care of them. Oh, that old hag don't speak to strangers, and you're a stranger. Will she talk to you? I have spoken to her, got my ways. So be it. You helped me, and I'm no bore. Come with me. Alrighty, Johnny, let's go back to the village. Come on, Johnny, run. Come on, buddy. Come on, let's run. 
I hate this. You gotta like run circles around him to get him to run because you run faster than everybody in this game, which makes no sense. Zigzag. We got a fight coming up here, don't we? Watch out! Yep. I got you, Johnny. Don't worry. Don't worry, buddy. Oh, stupid water hag. What now, you piece of filth? Oh, got him missed on lock. GG, water hag. GG. Is there another one? No, there is. Come here. Come here, drowner. Come here. No, don't run away. Come here. There we go. I want to go loot the water hag. Where is this hers? No, that's the drowners. No, we're here. Here we go. Decent stuff to sell. That's the only reason I wanted the looter. When I do my completionist, I'll actually just be looting to loot for supplies, but in this, no need to do that. But uh, I actually today was able to pick up Dead Space 1, 2, and 3 repurchase. I have Dead Space 1 as a digital download, but I wanted the, uh, the case for uh, collection purposes. So I was, uh, so I picked that up, uh, for ten bucks today, had a bunch of extra pre-orders, had a buy two, get one free coupon, a bunch of different stuff, uh, shaved off a lot of the money. It was only like thirty, or 40, I think it was forty bucks, like, almost even, um, but, uh, with all that different stuff, I was Good. able to whittle it's it down. Clear. Not a crone in sight. I need to sing to Gran. That ought to calm her. Little Johnny softly gazing, fire waning pale. Pop a spark jumped out and whispered, Listen, I'm a tail. You, it got your voice back. I did, though I seem to have lost an octave somewhere in the process. I shall look for it when I get home. You're not allowed here, Johnny. You shouldn't have come. Calm down, Gran. Don't get angry. It's not good for you. The woman I asked about earlier. Forgive me, Gran, but this fellow absolutely must talk to the ladies. No. She's not allowed. Please, it's important. The fellow will be quiet. Gran, please hear me out. I found little Yagna when she got lost, did I not? Did I break Jenny's fever too? I did. I ask anything in return? No. Didn't even fuss about my stolen voice. Well, now I want something. Gran, help this fellow. Because otherwise he'll pester me day and night, even during potty time. His lass is missing. Perhaps the ladies can help find her, eh? Well, since you put it that way, Johnny, I'll help him. Come with me. Time for our meeting with the croons. Find out what else we can get out. Johnny's a good, See what else. good lad. Though the ladies don't like him. No. Foul creature, they say. Don't like him. Who are the women in the tapestry? Those are the ladies. Ladies lovely, with power o'er all, beseech I thee. Answer my call. Before you a worm crawls, wretched and small. How dare you disturb our rest, woman? I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Perhaps he only likes ashen-haired girls. It's clear you met her. Tell me everything. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. 
Tell me, have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? Oh, hard times are upon us, white-haired one. Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil reigns stronger than ever before. A dark power has surfaced near Down Warren. It feeds on hatred and disdain. Destroy the beast, and we will be grateful. Tell you all we know about this ashen-haired maid. Dark power? You need a knight errant, or a witch hunter, not a witcher. The alderman of Down Warren will tell you all. Remember to collect payment from him after you complete your task. And now our servant will bring you the dagger. I'll talk to the alderman, but I can't promise anything. Move, woman! Give the young man the dagger. And you, white one, return only once you've completed the task. Oh, you missed just right. On me way. Dagger. Gotta bring the dagger. The dagger. For you. Lady told me to give it to you. Here it is. The dagger. Place the alderman's payment on the stone. Stone bear. Stone shear, stone nose, stone ears. All right. First of all, let's steal a little bit from the from the croons. They do have some decent stuff, I think. Maybe not. Maybe it's just a bunch of dookie, and I'm wasting my time. Oh no! Right here, this is good stuff. That's nice value for selling. Because that's all that matters in this playthrough is how much I can sell you for. And let's head on down. I think there's a, there's a lot of stuff down here. Obviously, not all of it has value. I'm really looking for uh, dwarven spirits more than anything, just to repair, just to refill my potions. Bear fat, really. Okay, let's hop on over that. All right. Mostly just alchemy stuff, an empty bottle. Uh, some florins on some dead corpses, and I, I think that's it. So let's get on out of here, let's go talk to the Elderman of Down Warren about the village's problems. There was a wicked witch living in the mark. Roach, get over here. I'm listening to Johnny this sing. Alright, let's ride. There's a train blaring in the night. Okay. <laughs> the fact that I managed to weave those trees is impressive. Okay, so let's head up here. Here, I think this is where we need to be. Yeah, right here's the town. And the Elderman is right here. Oh, gotta do this. No, nope, didn't work. Okay. Ah! It had been working if it's I got him off the screen. Spun around a little bit. There we go. Greetings. Nice village. Aye, a real pearl of the swamps, if you say so. You get by all right? Aye, winter to winter. Somehow we survive. Recognize this dagger? Aye, master. I didn't know you belonged to them. Don't know why the PVR just cut out there, but it did. But looks like we should be good. So you know who sent me. Good. Easier that way. Forgive me. I didn't know you came from the Ladies of the Wood. They help you often? 
from the time of his cutting, every man is theirs. They be harsh mistresses, but they're fair. Just. Demanding they can be, but then nothing in life comes easy. Who drove off the plaguey heirs? Who gave us seeds to plant? Round the other villages, they be eating the soles of their boots, whereas we, well, we get along well enough. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the whispering hillock they lie. Unburied all. Fathers, sons, daughters and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. Ladies of the Wood don't know what this power is? They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they, for they sent you. I'll look around the Whispering Hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. Don't ye treat this evil light. All right, so we need to find out what's killing the villagers. Let's get back on Roach. Roach is out of here playing in the field. Come on, Roach. All right, Roach. Let's ride. Hopefully, I know what I can stick to. Oh, never mind, I can't stick to the road. There we go. I was going to say I can stick to the road, but it actually veers off away from the road. Oh, let's head up this way. There we go. Hey, look, a new... Come Seems on. like this would be a place of power, but I guess maybe it's not. It just kind of seemed like a place they put a place of power. Just playing through this game this many times and finding a lot of the places of power. Um, that seemed like one that might. Be gone! Come you no closer! Be gone! Come here, werewolf. Be gone! Be gone! Holy the powers will not I got the werewolf. I got the werewolf in the sun. Come here, you little shit. No. Stop healing. No healing. Ah ha ha! I did more damage. Medallion's humming. Show yourself. I place want of talk. power. It's gotta be. I want the place of power first, Carol. Calm down. We'll go get them in a second. We're gonna get this place of power first. Igni side intensity. Is that the fire one? Be gone. Yeah, I guess I'll use be the fire gone. one. Be gone. Oh, the, I'm stupid. The cave starts up here. Alright. The powers that protect me. They sense whence you come. Oh, huh, I'm surprised that doesn't open it up. And the light them on fire. So I guess we gotta swim. Go ahead. Come on. Dive, Geralt. Seeing if there's any loot. Oh, oh, oh these are chests. Hold on. A Dorian sword. Wonder what this entails. Once we get out of the water, I'll check it out. Okay, let's see. Head over to inventory. It is better than my steel sword. It's also damaged, but I want the chance to cause bleeding. So unless I have another thing that... No, I want the chance to cause bleeding. All right. Why have you come? Why spill this blood? Are you here to grant me death? Or is my freedom your wish? You claim to be imprisoned. How so? I am bound here 
inventors of magic. I wonder and endless. I love them so the children. I know all. I know what awaits them. Free me, please. I must help. If something threatens the orphans, I'll help them myself. The children have been taken. Free me, please. I can be a gale, a gallop unchained. I shall save them. Only I can. I don't believe you, spirit. Too many claim you're evil. Your words alone, not enough. Dare haunt me. And against you will rise all the powers of nature. You one, one second. Calm, calm it down. Calm it down. All right. Got to remember, I have to kill the the guys first, right? I got to kill the, the 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 things that spawns first, and then I attack it, right? I think so. I think that's how it works here. Right, because if I come over here, I can't hit it. Can I? No, I can't. Well, maybe I hit all those away. I don't remember how you. I okay. must live. I must. If I can sit here and wait on its branches, can I just kill it? Yeah, you can kill it that way, huh? <laughs> Okay, so there's another. So there were multiple. There's multiple ways to kill that thing. You can just sit there and wail on it. Oh, oh, you can loot it. Diamond dust. Nice. All right. Um, let's get back to the aldermen. Tell them that we take. We've taken care of. Where are they? Oh yeah, they're down here. Get the slide. There we go. Hey, buddy. I got your kill. I killed him. Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? An evil spirit had possessed a tree on the hill. It was responsible for the killings. How'd ye dispel this evil? Some being had come to possess the tree's heart. I destroyed the heart and its inhabitant. So it were a ghost? Will it be back? No. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Aye, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. There's payment. Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? Tis our pact. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So, all those ears in the woods... Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive... Must seek his own protectors. Whatever, whatever you say, buddy, whatever you say. Whatever floats your boat. Ooh, we got some hunting boots, some hunting gauntlets. Your weapon, young man. 
is even lovelier in real life. Mm. In real life, you're different than you were in the tapestry. Well, bring it here. Never seek to cross us again. We shall forgive you this transgression, for you've done well. Your children are plump as piglets, sweet as caramel. But now we must talk to our white-haired friend. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. She belongs to no man. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seeds sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. Come. It is another woman who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. Our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Thin as a rail. Terrified. Exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. Is this going somewhere? Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word. So tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, brave boy. All right. So, what's this? Uh, what's this we goes ahead and move? We knew someone special to arrive. We read beast entrails, saw the omens. We would glimpse her likeness, a mirage in a puddle. She came from the lower swamp. We knew not at first it was her the omens had spoken of. A child of the elder blood. The soul seed that will burst into flame. She fell into our hands. Elder blood. Mm, the blood of the treacherous. No point in dawdling. The table's set. The cauldron bubbles. We cannot! You know she is meant for him! Emlyrith will get her. He will. But not whole. <laughs> well said. We'll just have a sample. I'll take her feet. Lovely. I'm <laughs> plump. Perfect for a broth. Oh, I can taste it already. Very well. Get on with it! No, oh, you'll regret that girl. Regret it dearly. Come. 
Come back. All right. Come I'm going to pause it. And um, I'm going to cut the episode here. And the next one we will be doing continuing, or I, don't, I guess starting this part of series story. Uh, so I will catch you guys then. Peace out.